<laughs> Seriously, Jack, what made you do it? Well, I, I, I uh, uh, Sam, I, uh... Ms. Shankoff, I'm gonna be home by six. Jack, everybody's really pumped. Come on! Is this some kind of a joke, Dick? Are you still trying to get even with me? Why would I want to get even with the most generous man on the planet? I still can't believe you did that. Jane and I were way off base. He's on in 20, right? Let's hook him up. Wait, on what? Sam Samuels, my life. Oh, and uh, here are some suggested responses. to Southern California, where, in the most stunning act of personal generosity, Jack McAllister, former CEO of Global Dine, I'm your VP of Communications, Jack. ...funded the Funk Corporation's struggling pension fund. Whoa, 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 you said I just did what? <laughs> I love this guy. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> seriously, Jack, what made you do it? Well, I, I, uh, uh, Sam, I, uh... Uh, I, uh, I realized, Sam, that since the employees of Globadine had given me so much, it was time for me to give back to them. So yesterday, I wire transferred $400 million into the newly created Globadine Pension Relief Fund. <laughs> Let's take a look at what happened today when the first ex Global Dine employees received their shares of money. Many of these people had their entire life savings invested in the company and were delighted to learn their pensions had been returned. It is the first time in U.S. corporate history that a CEO has personally funded a bankrupted pension plan. This incredible gesture won't soon be forgotten by the people whose lives it has so dramatically affected. And this is just the beginning. In the comments, thousands more will be receiving a check for the full value of their lost pensions and life savings. You Jack, now go to hell. Great benefits. Yeah? Yeah. They trade energy. It's called Enron.